Hey, what's up everyone? It's Michael Bidoza, Blading with Chef Knives, and I am gonna unbox the 28 inch griddle from Blackstone Adventure Ready. Whoa! So, I had a tailgater dual combo burner. It had a griddle on one side and had a grill on the other side. And I actually took off the grill and used the burner there for a wok setup. Actually, I let my dad use the whole setup and he likes to do barbecue. He wanted it back. So as the loyal son that I am, uh, no questions asked, I just gave it to him. And so it prompted me to get something of my own for my backyard setup because I'm just obsessed with outdoor cooking right now. So here, let's check it out. Right out the box, you got your knobs. These are the new knobs with the nice little handles, screws. This is very nicely packaged. Um, I'm a big fan of Blackstone products, by the way. Manual, some boxes, uh, you got this, all right. You got this handy dandy box. So this box has your wheels for transport. You got two. You've got, I'm assuming this is your little holder for your drip pan. Another nice little black stone touch there. Um, some thingamajiggy, we'll figure that out. And then it's, oh my gosh, I swear I can get this. <laughs> Got good grips, bro. Ah. And then it's the cart handle. All right. Um, this is the side table. Now for the actual griddle, right? Or for the holder. Oh man, I gotta remember to lift my knees, right? Ugh. Okay, so like I was saying, it comes with two burners and this is like maximum flat top space that is gonna be perfect for, you know, this is good for four people, now I can expand to like friends and family. Um, we'll get into the we'll fold out later. Um, I'm assuming this is a drip pan. So this is a drip pan. And then, right, oh my gosh, this thing is heavy. Oh, all right, I'm getting my workout in today for sure. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh, look at the cool graphics. I love that you can see like exactly how much can fit on here. You got bacon, eggs. I'm so excited. I'm excited to cook on this. This is gonna be fun. Does anyone ever read the instruction manuals to do things? Oh, that's cool. There's a little lever here that holds the legs uh, from coming out. That's a nice touch. All right, so a huge part of the motivation on buying this specific model was that there was foldable legs. Uh, the foldable legs makes this a lot more easier to transport. So if I do want to take this to 
a blade event, have some tacos. It's just that much more easier to pack this into my car. So, I'm assuming this side with the shorter legs requires wheels. This thing's like Legos. This thing just like that. Boom. Boom. That easy, bro. That easy. So this is a propane holder, little did I know. Two different size screws. This one is for the propane holder, this one's not. How do you know which side is the front or the back? This would probably be the back, right? And then where is the back? Dude, this thing like requires a very precise uh, position on that hole, but we getting it. Cool, that's in. this is, but this will be the next thing that we're going to install. Now we're going to pull this guy out. I think this is for the propane. There we go. I love these perforated things. These are so much fun, actually. Look at these handles. These are nice, bro. So I'm pretty sure this is self-explanatory. Oh. oh, did you hear that? <laughs> Sounds good. Oh my gosh. All right, there's actually some screws here already there. So I'm loosen these screws. They're already pre-installed. And, and then these holes here have to go and that comes from the package here. So let's get these two screws here. There we go. And then I'm gonna put these two screws on the bottom. This thing, pretty sturdy. So coming up, the last piece here. This one requires the four screws, like that. And then they're gonna get married to this through that. That looks pretty sturdy. I'm assuming this thing goes right here. Oh. Dude, this thing is so heavy. I think my back hurt. I'm excited. This is it, bro. This is it. Oh. There she is. I did it. Okay, so well, first thing I noticed right off the bat, um, my floor isn't level, so I'm gonna have to add a shim. There's not like adjustable legs. All right, not quite sure how long that took. That had to be like 30 minutes. She's ready to go. This is a great little touch with the propane holder. Um, I've got this all nice dialed. The knobs um, are the new knobs. Um, I'm ready to 
get this thing started. This is the Blackstone Adventure. Uh, hope you enjoyed that boxing or unboxing and you got to see all the stuff and how to assemble. I am going to season that. I'm probably going to put this in a separate video um, and I'll show you how to season your black griddle.